Hey YouTube, it's Kiba here, and time for another weekly vlog! Woohoo! Yeah, um, I'm really sorry that I didn't make one last week. Um, I started making one, and then it just, it just, it just... Alistair, stop making noise! So... I don't know if you can hear that, but that's my rat playing with a water bottle. Anyway, um, Alistair, chill. <laughs> anyway, um, last week I started making a video and it just didn't turn out nicely and it just, like, stupid stuff happened. So, um, I'm gonna update you guys this week. Sorry, I skipped a week. Yeah, also last week I was really, really busy. Like, um, let me just switch hands for a moment here because that was uncomfortable. Um, <laughs> Okay, so, um, was it Monday or Tuesday? I had my first day at work, um, at GameStop. It was really awesome. Um, what was it? Wednesday, I had an interview with a, um, a woman from a dog daycare called Mary Mutz, and oh my goodness, I really hope I got the job there. I would love to work at a dog daycare. It's crazy being with 30 dogs at once. Oh, it's so fun, though. But, and one of my rabbits just fell over. Of course. I have to go check on her. Sorry about that. My rabbit falls a lot and what happens is sometimes she falls on her back and never ever ever put a rabbit on its back because they can become paralyzed. So a lot of times she falls on her back and then she's stuck there and can't get up. So I have to get her up. It's really scary. So if you ever have a special needs rabbit, just make sure there's someone there to watch it at all times. So. Anyway, um, I hope I got the job at the dog daycare because caring for 30 dogs at once is a lot of work, but it's a lot of fun. Then, um, did I even do anything Thursday? I don't remember. Oh, I had, um, I had two things to do, actually. I had a doctor's appointment and something else to do. So, yeah, and... Oh, 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 me and my mom went out a lot. We went um, shopping, food shopping and stuff, and then I went to a doctor's appointment. Oh, and I had an eye doctor on Monday. <laughs> yeah, so I did a lot this week. And then Friday, Saturday, I spent playing Warhammer with my boyfriend and his friends, and oh, it's so fun. Then Sunday, um, Sunday I just spent with my boyfriend, and then I made videos after he left, so that was it. And... Well, now I'm making, so yeah, I did a lot last week, so I was really, really busy, so I didn't really get to film. I tried filming it, but I never finished it, so, um, let's see, what have I been up to? Yeah, I did all that stuff, um, I haven't edited LPS Dog Grassy at all because I'm really lazy and it's just so annoying to edit on iMovie, ugh, really annoying. Um, I made a really cool video, a really cool, um, Smash Bros video with my friends, but, um, it was so funny that I have to edit it in certain ways, and I can't do that on my Mac with just iMovie, so I'm trying to get Final Cut Pro, and I don't really know how Final Cut Pro works, but I'm trying to get it, and it's not really easy to get it for free. Um, I usually use Sony Vegas, but for some reason I can't transfer my files through my hard drive, so I might just use my, um, what's it called, my SD card instead. The whole reason I bought the flash drive, the hard drive, was to transfer large files. Urgh. It's a good thing I have a 64 gig SD card. So, um, I haven't written anything for my series, um, I have to be in the mood to write sometimes, but, um, writing scripts, why, where, why, where, where are the, sh oh, okay, the shadow's coming from my hand, okay. I was like, what is going on, why is it getting dark? Because I already have poor lighting in my room, I just have one light. I need to get, like, a nice lamp to provide some good lighting. Um, so yeah, uh, what was I saying? I don't really remember. Um, hmm. Oh, yeah, um, 
So I'm just, oh, writing, writing, writing. Okay, yeah. Um, writing scripts is a lot easier than writing stories, so I guess, I think it's a little bit easier for me to write scripts, so that's good at least. Um, I have a few concepts for LPS Customs. Um, I already started working on a lot of them, actually. Um, I will be right back, because I'm going to get the one that I finished yesterday. Um, so yeah, I just finished this one yesterday. She's my little he, she, I don't know. He's my little chinchilla. He's, I th wanted to do a winter themed pet and I thought of a uh, winter chinchilla. That's not really chinchilla because it has antlers and stuff. He has these cute little freckles. He has a snowflake in his eye. And this eye came out perfect and then this eye is all messed up. <laughs> he has a cute little scarf that I sculpted onto him. He has, um, fur coming out of his ears, fur is on the side of his face, like a lot of fur, so, yeah, this was my own original design, so please don't copy him exactly, um, but yeah, I like him a lot, and I like how he turned out, um, it took me quite a while to paint him, um, most, also, sculpting the antlers was absolutely awful. <laughs> it took me quite a while to um, to paint him because I was watching The Walking Dead while I painted him and I'm actually all caught up. I just finished season five so now all I have left is the new season that's out right now but it's not on Netflix so I'm not watching it yet. So I don't know when I'm gonna watch it. I'll probably watch it with my dad on on TV whenever it's recorded. So yeah I don't know if he's up for sale yet. He probably will be eventually. But right now I like him a little too much to put him up for sale. So, um, he's, I believe he's my first original character that I sculpted using Kineditite. Because I know I have one other, but it wasn't that original. It was just an alicorn. So, yeah, it's my first. Maybe, maybe it's not. Yeah, no, I'm a liar. Um, oh no, that's a... <laughs> Yes, this is my first original character that I sculpted using Kinect's tight, okay, and a theme in mind. Because I was like, I saw my Psy Bunny custom, and I was like, oh yeah, totally, um, I sculpted that with Kinect's tight, and I realized, I was like, oh, that wasn't an original character. <laughs> so this is my first original character I sculpted with Kinect's tight. Um, I'm working on some others. Right now I have this little Christmas Chihuahua that I'm working on right now. She's extremely detailed as you can tell obviously I already base coated her she's got little lights wrapped around her she's got Christmas ornaments stuck to her face and one on her tail Whoop. speaking of her tail she's got a little mistletoe on her tail she's got a Santa hat she's got a little present yeah I really love Christmas so um, I thought of a Christmas themed um, animal would be really cute and I had three of the space figure, so I figured I would use it. Um, also, I cut off the ear to make the hat, in case you couldn't already tell. Yeah. So, this one is also my own original design, but you can't, you can only really copy the sculpted parts, not necessarily because I didn't, anything else because I didn't paint it yet. <laughs> um, then we have Applejack. Uh, I have yet to paint Applejack, but, um, I sculpted her. Not really too thrilled with how the hair came out, but I'm certainly getting a lot better with sculpting. The hair is a lot smoother than the Fluttershy one was. Um, and I have my little galactic polar bear here. I sculpted the, um, the paw here. And the little Saturn. He's gonna be like all, he's gonna be like a galactic theme, so space themed I guess. So um, I thought a simple repaint would be kind of boring since a lot of people do that, so I added this because I thought it would be really really cool. Um, I'm also doing a candy themed uh, fairy. I actually started sculpting it but I dropped it on the floor and the only sculpted piece I had broke off, so I have to sculpt again. So all I did was remove the paint from her. She's going to be extremely, extremely detailed, so. <laughs> um, 
I still never did anything with my Shinx custom because I need to sculpt the tuft of fur on the top of his head and I also really just don't like the way he came out so I might re-sculpt him I don't know I'm not really sure what I feel like doing but I haven't done anything with him in a very long time and the paint's very 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 dry now because it's been so long um oh yeah that's about it regarding my customs sorry about that <laughs> um, so that's about it regarding my customs um, a bunch of them are up for sale on eBay and Etsy I will put links in the description um, Fluttershy was up for sale but I think I'm going to take her down because I kind of want to finish all my um, My Little Pony customs and uh, take a picture of all of them and then put them all up for sale at once so we'll see about that um, also, um, I sold this little kitty, and I will show you to her, I mean, show her to you before I ship her. <laughs> okay, so, I sold this little custom here, my little cat, with her eye sewn shut. She's got little stripies everywhere. I sold her and I'm going to ship her today. Woohoo! So I thought I'd use her just one more time on video. Not that I ever used her before. Um, <laughs> before I ship her out. Um, I just put a little bit of clay over the eye. I don't remember exactly what clay I used because this was before I used Kinetotite. It's a very, um, <clears throat> It's a very rough clay, so that's why I used it, because it was easy to make it look rough looking and creepy, so I hope you guys like her, because she was sold and she has found her new home, woohoo! So. Okay, so I know I said that um, I was going to try and sell Applejack and Fluttershy and all the uh, my Little Pony customs together once I finish them, but um, good news! Fluttershy was already sold actually, but um, sorry if I'm talking with a little bit of a southern accent. <laughs> Been watching Walking Dead, so Whew. episode three killed me. Whew. Not even gonna get into it. Um. I just stop crying. <laughs> so, um, Fluttershy was actually sold. She was sold for $35, and she's very, very popular. A lot of people wanted to buy her. I'm sorry for those of you who couldn't, and she'll be shipped off to a new home. And, um, I probably will make another Fluttershy someday, and I really like the way that this one came out. She's very, very detailed. She's got the... Her tail does the thing that it does in the show where it like falls over the floor like a little swirl and then it's curly at the side and everything so yeah I like how Fluttershy turned out I like her a lot better than um how Applejack turned out honestly but maybe Applejack will look a little better when she's painted I just really don't like the way the front part came out but yeah so Fluttershy will be shipped off um Tomorrow's Veterans Day, so I might not be able to, but I will try to ship her out. So nice to use her on video one last time, because I have used her in videos before, but I never posted them. Um, so yeah. This is Fluttershy. She's got the fancy detailed wings, and she can be displayed from most mostly all sides because she looks really cool and detailed with all of them. Just the back is pretty ugly. <laughs> Got improved somehow. Um, I made the wings using a tutorial by Pia's Little Customs on her channel. A uh, wing sculpting tutorial. So, no this wasn't completely my own like skill and creativity that made these wings. It was completely used a tutorial so I hope you guys like her and she found herself a new home so she's flying away 
And you know what she has to say about that? Yay! <laughs> so, she'll be shipped off to her new home tomorrow, and I hope whoever bought her really, really loves her, because I worked super duper hard on her. Her paint job came out really neat, especially the eye. It came out so super duper neat. And the best I think I've done with custom eyes before, so. Okay, um, I got a bunch of new LPS in the mail. I'm gonna make another um, new LPS video, but I have just so many, like, so many of those videos. I'm trying to space it out between, like, when I upload those and when I upload other things. But, um, it's difficult because those are, like, the easiest to make and they're the funnest to make. I mean, like, I have fun making all my videos. It's just hard to, like, stick to a schedule with any of them. So, um, yeah, that's about it. Um, hmm. yeah, no, not much else to say. Um, just playing a lot of video games. Um, thanks you guys for watching, and I'll see you again next week. Bye!